lioness is an older female, possibly her mother. But Matsumi can do nothing. She is chased off, and the old female is left alone to whatever fate awaits her. out into the grass. The central pride is now smaller by one lioness. It is always sad to watch the death of a lion or a hyena that we have come to know. But these endless cycles of life and death have continued throughout the ages. <laughs> Sometime during the night, hyenas have killed a buffalo. The young lioness is alone, scavenging from their kill. Their tolerance is short-lived. The calls of the hyena assault carry miles across the grassland to a male of the pride who is always eager to confront the hyenas. Usually, we think of lions as noble hunters and hyenas as lowly scavengers. Often it is the other way around. both arrived at an elephant carcass to scavenge. Even those regal lions compete for the rotten flesh. The rivalry reaches far beyond the competition for food. If animals can hate, this is a blood feud of hatred. and hunters have waged an ancient war against each other. It is often unpleasant to witness, desperately sad and horrifying, always deeply disturbing. Until now, this war has been veiled in the secrecy of darkness.
swift bite to the neck. And the new matriarch is dead. The day belongs to the lion. Incredibly, after the first attack, Chen makes no attempt to escape, and the 300-pound male strikes again. <laughs> Chen has been bitten and mauled, but he's so out of it, he still doesn't try to get away. And this king of the jungle wants another piece of him. attracts the entire southern clan. As the numbers mount up, the battle begins. like the hyenas. Matsumi's pride is attacked and chased. As they retreat, one female is separated behind the line of attack by the intruders. She is surrounded and seriously injured. With only 
a few minutes of respite between attacks. The female is tormented through.